And when it came to autonomous nodes uh, just a week ago in Bob Press, they inherently had access to all your variable information within scope. A lot of these variables weren't necessary to be feeding to every autonomous node call. And luckily with the new variable management system, that won't be happening at all again. We are moving from what was an opt out system to an opt in system in the inspector on the right. There's now a section in which you can add variables. Whatever I pick here, these will exclusively be the variables that this node will have access to and everything else will be as if it was secret. That is the change and it's so much more elegant and so much easier to use. I do want to address what happens to legacy nodes. And the simplest answer is they work exactly like they did a week ago. Existing legacy autonomous nodes will just basically be granted full access to everything as long as there wasn't a secret variable. If there was a secret variable, it would not be added here. With that in mind, I would highly recommend taking a couple minutes and going through the list of variables that I have access to and clean out the stuff that it does truly not need access to. That's the new change. It just dropped earlier this week, but just a much more simple way for variable management with autonomous nodes.